When I was around eight years old, I wanted to be an astronaut. I would look out at the stars and you know, I thought, that's something that I'm gonna do one day. I'm gonna be able to reach for the stars. So when I got to college, I joined the NASA Student Launch and almost every single person was an aerospace engineering major. And that's when I thought, maybe this is where I belong. Switching to aerospace engineering was a long process. I wasn't prepared for the rigorous amount of work it took in college. I decided to seek outside help, and someone who did reach back to me was Dr. Terry Gomez. That email struck me on a number of levels. She said, there is no college that more exemplifies learn by doing than engineering, and that's where I want to be. She would, just had one more class that she needed to achieve a higher grade in order to meet the GPA requirement, and that semester she met it. Oh, when I finally got accepted into aerospace, I was so, so ecstatic. And my dream of becoming an aerospace engineer was, was going to happen. And then summer of 2019, I found out that I was pregnant. When my family found out I was pregnant, they were really shocked. A lot of it was met with, you know, confusion, a little bit of anger, and I just felt like I disappointed them. I reached back out to Dr. Terry Gomez. I told her I was pregnant and the first thing she said to me was, congratulations. One of the people that she got me connected to was Dr. Cecilia Santiago Gonzalez. And she was actually pregnant at the time as well. I related to her as a mom and I just felt that connection and I always worried about her and checked on her. It meant a lot to me because I had people on campus with me saying, hey, it's okay. You can do this. My boyfriend, Ricardo, he was a really big cushion for me during that time because when I was facing a lot of backlash, his first reaction was, we're gonna be okay. There was a lot of sleepless nights. I would have my daughter in one arm and a book in another, and I told myself, my daughter is going to be the reason I finish school, not the reason I stop. Walking across that stage in commencement is a feeling that I can't even begin to put into words because that is a moment that I will never forget in my life. Liara Menta Dominguez. I spent eight long years trying to get this degree and I really, really did it. And I kept true to the promise that I set out from the very beginning. I was overcome with emotion to be able to hug her and know it was about showing her daughter that her mother could work through hard stuff. It might have taken her a little bit longer. It might have been harder, but I never, ever doubted that she would accomplish this. I did not imagine that life would take me down this path. I made a good amount of mistakes and my path changed multiple times, but I'm glad it did. I accepted a job offer from Northrop Grumman. I love where I'm at now and I'm, I really made something of myself.